Welcome. Please insert keycard. Processing. Access to Site81's database has been granted. Secure. Contain. Protect. Item hash. SCP-2728 Objects Class, Euclid Special Containment Procedures, the section of land from which SCP-2728 can be viewed is to be cordoned off, marked as private property, and designated Research Area 27281. Research Area 2728 must be disguised as civilian-owned land. All security cameras should be hidden and subjects who cross into Research Area 2728 must be detained. Detained subjects should be interrogative and given Class C amnestics before being released. Description: SCP-2728 consists of a small area containing an office building in Barcelona, Spain. It can only be viewed from a specific viewpoint 25 kilometers outside of city limits now designated Research Area 2728. Any and all attempts to reach the office building have failed, with subjects instructed to the point of SCP-2728's existence instead viewing a street corner in a pedestrian neighborhood. While SCP-2728 is visible, the area around it also appears slightly modified to accommodate for its existence. For example, the buildings around it appear smaller and spaced in such a way to allow the office building's position. SCP-2728 appears to be inhabited, with close viewing showing business hours between 8 o'clock to 1800 hours. SCP-2728 is inactive on Sundays, only occasionally being visited by a subject assumed to be the custodian. Extensive observation of SCP-2728 since 19 has recorded over 14,000 individuals who appear to have interacted with SCP-2728. Where these subjects go when they are not within SCP-2728 is unknown. Most subjects within SCP-2728, hereby designated SCP-2728-A appear to have real-world counterparts. The SCP-2728-A subject looks exactly like the real-world subject, and shares the same name too. Similarity of personalities and other factors is hard to determine, due to the nature of SCP-2728. Most counterparts of SCP-2728-A live inside Barcelona, or nearby, but some live as far away as South Africa. Addendum 2728-1, on September, 20, a test was conducted involving Agent Law Farrier. A research team, stationed at the SCP-2728 viewpoint, instructed Agent Law Farrier through a cell phone. Law Farrier was given directions to SCP-2728, and informed of its anomalous properties. The goal of the test was to confirm no changes in the behavior of SCP-27283. Agent Law Farrier reported no change in the behavior of SCP-2728, stating that he was still looking at a street corner. However, the research team observed an identical copy of Agent Law Farrier, appearing awestruck, looking up at SCP-2728. Further observation showed the copy attempting to talk into a white cell phone identical to the one given to Agent Law Farrier, appearing confused and frustrated. Agent Law Farrier was instructed to return, and was subsequently detained. No other tests to date have yielded similar results. The following is an interview with Agent Law Farrier upon his return to the research team. The following interview was conducted by Dr. Hillenberg following detainment. Agent Law Farrier was designated SCP-2728-1 following the incident. Date, 9-slash-slash-interviewer, Dr. Hillenberg interviewee, SCP-2728-1 begin log Dr. Hillenberg, how are we doing today, Law Farrier? SCP-2728-1, okay, I guess. Still don't know what's going on, but I'm in for the ride. Dr. Hillenberg, please recall your experience while being directed to SCP-2728. SCP-2728-1, well, 
I followed directions. I don't know what else you want me to say. I took a left here, a right here, all by foot, landed at the site of SCP-2728, saw the street corner like usual, and was told to come back. Dr. Hillenburg, please elaborate on exactly what happened once you reached the site of SCP-2728. SCP-2728-1 Well, after I saw the street corner, and reported I saw the street corner, there was a long pause from the research team's end. They didn't say anything for a while. But then, then they did, and I came back. What else do you want me to say? Dr. Hillenburg, absolutely anything you can say about the incident. SCP-2728-1, what incident? I was not informed. Dr. Hillenburg, please remain calm, we don't do anything without reason. SCP-2728-1, pauses, fine, it's fine. Okay. There's one other thing. When I saw the street corner, I got a head rush. You know, vision goes fuzzy, hearing is muffled. You get them all the time when you stand up too fast or something. Is that what you wanted to hear? Dr. Hillenburg, that is exactly what I wanted to hear. Thank you for your cooperation. In log after the log, Agent Law Ferrier was informed of the incident, and placed in a normal human containment cell. Agent Law Ferrier resisted, but ultimately allowed himself to be contained. Edit, after a week, Agent Law Ferriers has been let out of containment, and has taken back his previous position. It is still largely unknown if Agent Law Ferrier is anomalous. Agent Law Ferrier continues to be heavily monitored. Addendum 2728-2 on April, comma 20, comma a bright flashing light shone through the windows of SCP-2728 at 2100 hours. After initial observation, it was shortly discovered to be Morse code. The following is a transcription of the Morse code, beginning shortly after the light started flashing. Begin log, ND I don't know if you are there, pause. I checked the hill and there was no fence and no research team I am beginning to think you have left me pause, or that I have entered another place, pause, point is I have no idea what's going on and you need to get me out of here, pause, I don't get IT, pause, everything here is normal I can't find any anomalies or foundation ITS like you don't exist, pause, you didn't tell me this could happen you fucks I now have a fucking office job in this stupid building because of you, pause, and yelling at people in Morse code is not as cathartic as you'd expect. Pause, ITS like there's nothing here, pause, ITS to normal M, pause, scared, pause, you didn't tell me, long pause, fuck OFFN log in SCP-2728 A individual, identical to Agent Law Ferrier, has been seen working in SCP-2728 since the incident. It is assumed this SCP-2728 individual is the same seen during the law Ferrier test, and the one that sent Morse code. Addendum 2728-3, on May 20, a bright flashing light shone through the windows of SCP-2728 at 2100 hours, similar to the previous event. Staff already at the viewpoint were able to catch the message in its entirety. The following is a transcription. Nobody here, pause, they all work and do nothing, pause, I feel this I S N T even Barcelona, pause, not even a copy, pause, no one here knows, pause, I T S like the Ransex, pause, S K Y is never blue, pause, never, pause, black, long pause, there's nothing outside city limits footnotes one. Roughly 5 square kilometers in an ovoid shape. Details can be found on a map of research area 2728. 2. Names gathered from observation of name tags and desk plaques, among other things. All objects have been viewed via high definition cameras, binoculars, and similar equipment. 3. These regular tests are performed every 4 months, 